Even though national carrier Kenya Airways still has one remaining hurdle for the big lift off to the USA, it has begun preparations for the inaugural flight. We are just launching on, uh, in a few weeks, August the 1st, a completely new redesigned product, uh, product on board, food, different uniforms. We are, we, we are revamping, we are using this opportunity to relaunch marketing-wise uh, our airline. According to sources, the airline is taking a more Africanized theme in its offering. All this as it expects to climb to the pinnacle of marketing destination Kenya to the USA in the new route. We grew almost 18% to over 114,000 arrivals into the country and we expect with the introduction of KQ flight daily we should go to over 20% growth in that market. What a beautiful Boeing jet. This was revealed during a luncheon hosted by the airline for visiting U.S. Under Secretary of Commerce, Gilbert Kaplan and his delegation. Kaplan applauded KQ's efforts towards achieving the Category 1 status last year. I think it's safe to say that Kenya Airways is really doing its part as it finalizes preparation for the, from the, for the new direct flight to the U.S. So I want to con convey my sincere congratulations on that and my appreciation for the strong U.S.-Kenya partnership in aviation. The government also weighed in its support for the airline to grow the economy. This coming in the wake of ongoing negotiations for a public-private partnership agreement between KQ and the Kenya Airports Authority. What contributes from Kenya Airways to our GDP is huge and we need to increase that even much more. And we are going to invest a lot more in terms of making sure that indeed Nairobi is a true hub, indeed Kenya is a true hub. And this will mean investments additional investments to make sure that business people coming to this country can see the value for money. In the PPP, KQ is set to manage staff and operations of JKIA as KAA serves as the contracting authority. Once the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration gives the final nod for this plane known as the Zambezi River to commence direct flights to the United States, Kenya Airways hopes that this will be able to boost its revenues by up to 10%. Mombiwaroe Citizen TV or the KQ Hangar in Nairobi.